Alright, so here I am in the Kanksee River. Oh, a snake. Here it is. Oh, cool. Looks like a banded water snake. Obviously, it has bands and it's in water. I like snakes, they're pretty cool. So, it probably eats minnows and bugs and things like that. It's not poisonous, you can tell by its head. Uh, generally, your constrictors are not going to have a very diamond shaped head. That will be your vipers and ones that have actual venom sacs. So that is pretty cool. I'm going to have to do some research and just see how common it is. I just walked down the boat ramp and there he is. So I just I just love going to different areas and seeing different type of wildlife. And the only way you do that is you go out and you do a lot of exploring. If you don't go out and explore, you won't get the opportunity to see that. But because I'm not moving, it doesn't perceive me as a threat anymore. But it's only probably about maybe 10 inches long, not a very big snake. Uh, I think they only get about two and a half feet long, as big as they get, so he's a young and he probably wants to stay into the shallows because if he gets out there too deep, um, there's small mountain bass in here and, and he or she would be a male. So that's pretty cool. Banded water snake. Oh, and here's the swans. Okay, that kind of answered me about the swans. I'm thinking they might be, hi guys, they might be uh, friendly. Well, how you doing? You guys are pretty. Yeah. Well, how you doing? I don't have any food for you. I'm sorry. I bet you guys get fed a lot, huh? Yeah. Well, you guys are very gorgeous. Well, thanks for coming over and saying hi. I appreciate it. Well, that was unexpected. So I'm thinking they're probably somebody's pets. Or... They just know I'm a person who likes wildlife. So I've never known them to get this close. And I don't know if I if I move closer to the water, will they come up and say hi to me or not? Remember, they, they can be somewhat dangerous, but they do seem friendly. Well, hi, guys. Well, thanks for coming over and visiting. I don't have any food for you. Hey, Shelly. Check it out. Hi there. Oh, hi there. He's grooming. Well, let's see if they want to be petted. I don't know. How are they doing there, guys? Hi there. Oh, hello. Aw. What are you guys doing? Yeah, you're pretty. Yes, you are. You guys are pretty. Yep. What do you like? Crackers? What's it you like? Oh, I can't stay down there like that that long. So it's kind of like, you know, double bonus points. Having them come out and visit. So let me walk down here and see what I can else can see. Maybe some other wildlife. So we got some water bugs. And that looks like freshwater clams. Now, I don't know if you can see them, but you got some very small fish there. And then these, I think these are clams. Oh, well, it was a clam. So it's a clam shell. Or mussel, as we call them. That's pretty cool. Let's see what else we can find here along the shoreline. This is why I love exploring. So, some very cool and friendly swans. Hi guys, thanks for stopping by. And this is why I brought my water shoes, so I could do this. So a lot of small minnows and fries, and they have to stay up here close, otherwise they become what's known as food. <laughs> 
Let's see what else. A lot of little tiger flies. So they're 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 a smaller cousin. Oh, there's oh, the dragonfly just went by. And you got water beetles. And you got a lot of fry, a lot of baby fish. And that's a good sign. Those swans came up and said hi to me. Yeah. They almost, I thought, you know, if they had some crackers, they probably were a little disappointed. They didn't have crackers. And then there was a banded water snake there. Just a little one, only about maybe 10 inches. He took off when the swan showed up. Don't blame him. So, yep, some more fish. Yep, there's another freshwater clam or, or mussel opened up. Some people make jewelry out of that. If you walk enough of the shoreline, you'll, you will come up to other things. So there's those dragonflies. You got orange ones, which we've seen at my pond. Those I see at my pond all the time. Tiger flies. Tiger flies a lot of times will land on me. There we go. That's a tiger fly. And some of these flip flop. I have got stuck out there. So with all the fish and dragonflies and water beetles and banded water snakes, telling me the ecosystem is pretty healthy. They haven't kicked up any big fish yet. Sometimes they will come in close. Those are trying to get some food. There, something was up close. Hmm, I think raccoon. Looks like raccoon tracks. Oh, there's a pretty flower. Lots of those. There's a duck up ahead. If I can catch him. So just checking out the shoreline of the Kinky Key River. Hope you all enjoy these wildlife videos, and I'll try to have more. Everyone have a wonderful, wonderful day.